You're welcome to the night show. Joining us today is Joe Praise as he tells us how to be holier than thou. And of course, your doctor, doctor of Dr. Foy and your super sexy Spartan, DJ Pompey. It's the cool night show. I beg, please, let's stop this false scarcity. I'm begging, man, I'm begging, we're suffering. <laughs> Today we have a fantastic guest in the building. Back then he was called Joe P, but now he's called Joe Praise. He's, he's a gospel fantastic artist with a very, very interesting physique. I don't know if he's singing for the love of the ladies. I've seen this thing before. <laughs> oh my God, that place, that place, that place. I don't know. It's the night show. <laughs> we'll be back with Small Talk and Mr. Joe Praise. It's time for a small talk, please. More claps. Can I have my claps, please? More claps, please. More claps. More claps. More claps. How you doing? Now, today on Small Talk, we have very, very funny gist, like really funny gist. Now, the first one is a woman dies. Yo, she boy up, start. Poppy, clap, poppy, clap yourself. I clap like you don't there. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, a woman dies in America, and then she gives all her fortune to guess what? Her animals. And she has a daughter. <laughs> Apparently, when she was a, a, a teenager, she left with her boyfriend. And the mom said, you, my daughter, I will catch you. And I will do you bad thing. <laughs> now, 20 years later, she dies and leaves no dime for her child. <laughs> her child is in poverty because, do you understand how life happens? And she went to court. And the court gave her 1064 1,064 pounds. <laughs> Thank you, judges. But come on, mother, you guys, please forgive. You, you get the point, come on. Next news, please. <laughs> now, in Abia State, a, a man cut off a woman's hand, his wife's hand, because he heard she was committing adultery. He heard. <laughs> it's not funny. It's not it funny, man. Apparently, they took the wife's hand to his hometown to bury the hand while he's in court. So what if she didn't commit an adultery? Poppy, what should we do to that man? Please, should we cut off his leg or cut off his <laughs> You get the idea because he's fair. One good cut deserves another cut. Um, now, in Zimbabwe, this, this popular lion, we all know him, his name is Cecil the Lion. Now, Cecil was shot dead last month. And guess who shot dead, Cecil dead? A dentist. His name is <laughs> Mr. Walter James Patterson. And he said that, hey, come on, his own pleasure is king animals. <laughs> And he paid $36,000 for that. Now, I'm, I'm thinking, why would you want to kill a lion for that amount of money? What's wrong with you, man? What, what's doing, man? Kill something. Kill, you understand? Kill, don't kill lions. That's what <laughs> yeah, funny, man. But in France, recently in France, um, a lady wearing a bikini was beat up by some other ladies <laughs> for dressing immorally. And they beat hands with their beat hands to feet. <laughs> My mother, come on, where, where you come, where, come on. And he went to court and he said, Come on, you don't, it's not summer, dress up. But fans, come on, relax. So it's just, it's, she's wearing bikini, she's not naked, you understand? She's not naked. But beat her! <laughs> Flog her. Flog her. Now, in, um, in, in London, this rich prince from Saudi Arabia came and parked his Porsche in the middle of the road and, and they washed it in the middle of the road. But <laughs> yeah, we have money, money, money. Now he just came and said, you know what, hey, I came from Saudi Arabia, my car is dirty. He parked in the middle of the road and washed his car. His car cost one million pounds. And other cars watched and parked as he washed his car. <laughs> yeah, he was when he was. You understand? You get the idea? But those in Nigeria, there's last man in Nigeria, don't try it. <laughs> and finally, a man from Adoe Kitty has said that he wants to divorce his wife. 
Please <laughs> listen. He is 75 years old and his wife is 53 years old. And guess, guess the reason why? Because she has refused to sleep with him. <laughs> Man, 75, come on. Come on. Papa is, is, is 30 and he's dead. <laughs> but he's 75 and he's like, hey. And I'm like, don't divorce. Try and make peace. And as we speak, then cuts. Please, you guys, take it easy. Life is that simple. We'll be right back with Mr. Joe Brady in the building. Oh, okay, Joe P. Let's go. <laughs> My city, then they call me Bombay. Big women looking for pretty. Call me Diddy, then I take a woman like a guinea on down. Like a guinea, you're poor down. I saw like I'm going to get you to calm down. My polo, I'll be boss like a good polo. Be nice, she don't know that I want to lose. And she put it with them on the cruise. She wants it to lose on the Lolo, tell them she moves. Then I'm sipping juice on the Lolo. I want to know that. I'm going to go to the middle of the day. So, did you like what you just saw? I know you did. Mm -hmm. It's very simple. If you want to see more, just subscribe to our channel right now.